In this section, we'll discuss the advantages of using audio as opposed to video or print. History has shown that many societies had oral traditions, stories and information being passed down through generations. Even today, sound, voice, and audio are important formats. Taking advantage of radio networks and audio podcasting is an excellent way to reach thousands and thousands of people. So, what are the strengths of audio? Digital audio has smaller file size, so in areas where internet is expensive or the connection is slow, audio provides an alternative to video in that the smaller files are more accessible to larger numbers of people. Audio can be seen as more personal. Typically, people listen to radio when they are alone. It isn't usually a shared experience like the theater. If you are wearing headphones and actively listening, the story is literally in your head and you are highly engaged. By not having images, your imagination finds room to fill in other details. Another advantage with audio is that you can hear the actual voice of the person being interviewed and their real emotions telling the story of what happened to them. To an interviewee, audio is also less intrusive than a video camera. Your subject can be more comfortable sharing intimate details about their story. For campaigners or activists, this can help when it comes to storytelling for getting the message out about your campaign. When someone is confronted by a large camera and lighting setup, telling a story and being recorded can be intimidating. However, with audio, only a recorder and microphone is necessary. These can be a small, discrete size, and because they are easily transportable, can be taken to a location that is more natural and familiar to your subject. For a good interview, you want to make your interview subject feel comfortable and at ease. For more information about finding and selecting people for an interview, please check out our course making your own podcast.